Hello you lovely people and welcome. Today I'll be performing a cold start demo in the Azure Poly Charlie Mike 170 Forger Magister. And just to give you a bit of a heads up on the scenery I'm using today, uh, I'll switch things up a bit. This is Aviano Air Force Base in Italy. It's a freeware on, uh, uh, it's available from uh, FlightSim.2. So with that all covered, let's jump in the cockpit. First things first, let's have a look at the electronic flight board. And if you haven't done so already, make sure everything is set to cold and dark by clicking this button here. Next we're going to remove the covers and say goodbye to the flight board for now. Then we're going to switch on the battery, make sure all the indicator lights are on, make sure that we do have power to the aircraft. Then we're going to start the en first engine. Uh, we're going to grab the start here, drag to the left, red light will let us know that the starter has begun. And watch this dial here for the first needle to reach 1000 RPM. Beautiful sounds, really are good. Okay, so close enough, and um, we'll go to the left hand fuel cock and press the igniter switch and open the fuel cock. Now the needle will accelerate up to and settle at 7000 RPM. We'll switch on our generator and we'll wait for that to hit 4000 before we can switch off the igniter. Okay, switch off the igniter. Okay, now that should settle at 7000, which it has done. Okay, so we can do the same thing with the right hand engine. So drag over to the right. The light has come on to let us know that it has started. We'll wait for this needle to hit 1000 RPM. transitioning now okay it's close enough and right igniter on and right fuel cock open and now that will accelerate and settle at 7000 rpm or at least it should do. So while that's doing that, we'll zero out the barometric altimeter to zero feet above ground level, or field elevation, and we'll close the canopy. Lock it with this handle here. Okay, looks good. Right, we'll jump in the back and we will close that canopy. And we'll do that with the same process as the front, clicking on the strut and locking the canopy. Okay, so let's go on to the next step. Now we can switch on our aileron servos, go on to the electronic flight board, remove the chocks, close the flight board. Now we can come down and switch on our attitude indicator gyro here our compass gyro, come down to the left and switch on our nav lights to fixed. Okay, so that's all good for that. Uh, we can release the parking brake and now make our way to the end of the runway. We'll hold at the hold and we'll do our final before runway checks. Okay, so uh, we need to put the flaps down to 15 degrees for takeoff. Make sure our canopies are locked, which they are. 
uh, switch on the pitot heat and then switch on the oxygen supply which we do with this and switch on to 100% oxygen okay make sure the everything looks good before we roll onto the runway and it does so we'll switch on our landing light now the lightweight takeoff speed of the Magister as I previously stated is around 90 knots I'm slightly heavier so I'm expecting it to be a little bit later than that and a little bit quicker line up ok do our last minute checks ok all is good everything is where it should be we'll switch that to central ok and ok we're good to, good to roll so uh, let's let's get going Bottle up nice and slowly, holding the brakes. Okay, and brakes off. Okay, so I'm going to hold back on the stick slightly. Okay, gear up. up and switch the oxygen to normal and there we go that's the uh, cold start demo for the Azure Poly Charlie Mike 170 Forga Magister I hope that's helped um, if you got this far thank you very much and as always take care and I will see you in the next one